can see there's lights. Hello everyone, we're here with Grandmaster John at his auntie's house. We're going to continue the restoration for the house and what we're doing now is we're doing the planning and the survey for the solar project. We went to the house, we've taken measurements of all the distances and we're going to be putting solar panels on the roof. We're going to check the angle of the sun for our location to make sure what the best angle is and which side to put it on. And after we put the solar panels on, what we're going to do is we're going to put an inverter and a battery system in the house to make it completely off the grid and provide electricity here. It's going to have three lights in the building, one outside and one in each room, some outlets and some light switches for it. So this is our planning and sizing for it. Yeah, this will work. Um, do you have like a this? I don't want Uh, here with the next day of our installation. We've already purchased all the material. We're about to install the brackets for mounting the solar panel on the roof. We chose this side of the roof for its location because here the sun path, we want the, we want the solar panel to face south as close as it can. Right now it's going to face about 150 degrees rather than 180 and the path of the sun is going to come across like this. So with this location we're going to get as most, the most amount of sun as we can. And this is just the start of our mounting brackets. So, thanks. More to come. Hello everyone, really grateful to have you back and as you can see, there's lights. We uh, finished setting up our solar system. On top of the roof there's a solar panel and array which lead down here to our MPPT charge controller which goes to an inverter which takes the DC power from the solar panel to AC. We have a safety breaker here and a battery. The battery is charged by the solar panels 
and then goes to the inverter that in the breaker which charges this gives power to this outlet and these lights in AC we're in the Philippines right now so the power here is 220 volts 60 Hertz so we would be we just wanted to show you what we did today what we were able to accomplish we did it in just one day which is pretty amazing and so now there's electricity here and we would be really grateful if in the future you could help and donate more so we continue as you can see we still need a toilet so thank you, and I hope everyone has a great day.